today I'm going to do this look and I'm sorry I got like a little bit of eyeliner in there and I'm just too lazy to take it off right now um, but um, um I think I'm going to title it and this is going to be quite random but lately I've just been addicted to them um, the Eagles have a song called uh, Tequila Sunrise sorry Tequila Sunrise and um, and it kind of reminded me of that as you guys can see, there's some purple, there's some yellow, some pink, and some blacks in there. So first I'm going to prime my eyelid. And um, you can be using tape. Uh, I was going to use it. But then I started doing my this eye and I was just like, you know what? I'm just not going to use it. And if I mess up, oh well, I'll just grab a Q-tip and fix my line. So you just kind of want to blend that in. Okay, now as my highlight, I'm going to try to put it in right now. So I'm going to be using, it's called Sweet, Sweet Dreams uh, by Still Glamorous. So I'm just going to be grabbing some. It's, you don't really need a lot. Um, let me zoom in for you guys. Flat shadow brush. And I'm using Sigma SS252. And there we go, it's just a flat one. I'm just going to be grabbing some on my brush. You can kind of see the colors. Come on. Focus on it. Oh, it's not, gonna, it's not focusing on it. Um, but look at that. That's really pretty, huh? Okay. I'm going to be grabbing some more. And I am... There's a lot of shimmer in these colors which I'm really excited because when you do see a sunrise it's you know the early mornings the start of the day she started being sunny and shiny <laughs> so let me grab some more just about a good amount for a highlight it's okay we're gonna go back in there so close that shadow for now Okay, now with, I guess it would be just another um, eyeshadow brush. I'm trying to take it out. But it's kind of more of a, it has more bristles to it and it's flatter and it's shorter and it's rounder. You see that? There we go. And this is the Sigma SS239. And I'm, gonna be, I'm just going to be using Max Chrome Yellow. And... It's a really good yellow. It's bright. And I'm just going to be placing that right in here, like so. Just about... You're going to stop right about there. So. I'm going to pack my brush a little bit more. Like so. And you kind of want since you're gonna still have some left over kind of want to bring it down like so okay i'm just gonna place just a tad bit more okay i kind of went past the line that i wanted to pass but it's perfectly fine with that same brush just wipe it off just clean it I'm going to be using my Coastal Scents palette and I'm going to be using 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. The seventh row, the third from last, which is that pink, right in there. As you can tell, I've used it a lot. So I'm just going to be grabbing some on my brush. You see how pigmented that is? It's really nice. It still doesn't focus. I don't know why my camera is not. And just gonna place that right over that yellow and just kind of blend it this way first. Grab some more. And just kind of play with it like so. Now kind of wipe that off and blend those two edges in together. Like so, you see that? Okay, so the next color I'm using, it's the same row, the pink row, but it's going to be the bottom one, and it's kind of a mix between 
a nice pink burgundy and I don't even know but it's just a nice it's kind of like the color of my shirt so I'm just gonna be grabbing that and hopefully it focus on this no it's not gonna focus <laughs> so I'm gonna be placing that right out here now remember um, you can use tape which I would recommend but today I am just playing by my rules. <laughs> so I'm just gonna wipe that off. Just kind of blend those two in together. Like so. Okay. You can go back with those colors after you do your crease. So I am actually really, really excited because this is the first time I'm trying this on camera. Well, this brush on camera. And, um,. It's the Sigma uh, crease brush, and whoa, <laughs> and it's the SS224, and it looks like this. And I'm gonna be grabbing by Glamour Doll Cosmetics or eyeshadows, um, Glam Girl, and it's a purple. And if you guys can see, I'm just gonna grab some on my brush. Now, what I like doing is kind of shake it up first. And then it will give you some on your top. You see that? I'm just going to be grabbing some with this brush. I just kind of want to pack it in there. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm just kind of pack it in there. And this is what I want to do. I just want to place it right in my crease. Make that outer V with the purple. Just kind of, you know, keep building it up as much as you want. Like so. Just kind of wipe it off and blend really good. Okay. Now I'm going to keep that color open because I will be going back with it. If I can open. I'm going to be using Rock by NYX. And um, it's one of my shadows that I love. And I guess it's a must have for me. I'm just going to be placing that again with the same brush right in my crease. It's okay if it kind of just gets everywhere and, and such. Wipe it off. Just kind of blend that in. As you can see, though, that pink and that yellow kind of got toned down. It's okay. We're going to go back in there. Grab that purple again. Just kind of place it on top, like so. I'm gonna close that purple. That's a really nice purple. I know my camera is probably not picking it up as well, but it's a really nice pigmented purple. Okay. So now I'm gonna go back in there with my flat brush. That nice kind of little short stubby one. And I'm going to be grabbing some of my chrome yellow. I'm just going to be placing that right in here. Just kind of like so. You can do it, you can do it again with the pink. With the pinks. I'm going to be, I'm just going to do this really quick so you guys can see. Like so. Now, remember how I mentioned in the beginning that we will be going back in there with our highlight? That's the perfect time. This is the perfect time to do that. So I'm just going to be grabbing that. Oh, so glamorous. Um, I forgot the name of it. Sweet Dreams. I'm just going to be grabbing some off the top. And just kind of blend that downward. some in here and just kind of blending it downwards as you guys can see like so there we go they look a bit different, but it's fine. I think 
what happened was on this one I, I messed up with my line um now with your blending brush you still have some of that purple and just kind of bring some down in here oh it's whoa I stabbed my eye <laughs> and then you're just gonna line your lid oh my god and let's see I'm gonna actually that's not This one's messed up, but it's fine. So, curl your eyelashes, apply mascara, and that's pretty much it. And this one is messed up, so this is the way you kind of end up with. Sorry for the eyeliner. But if you guys have any questions or any requests, just let me know. And I'll be glad to help you guys all out. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.